episode six of the Reuben Review. We're here at Paul's Deli and Restaurant in Williamsburg, Virginia. The first and most important measurement is always temperature. The first time I had a Reuben from Paul's was back in January, and it was so hot it burned the top of my mouth. This visit, it was a lot more friendly to my mouth at 137 degrees. I always measure each half individually. Doing this measurement always reminds me of a very funny scene from the movie Casino. Robert De Niro gets a blueberry muffin that has no blueberries. His partner gets a blueberry muffin with tons of blueberries. I want you to put an equal amount of blueberries in each muffin. An equal amount of blueberries in each muffin. So just like Bobby De Niro, I'm looking for equal amounts of meat, kraut, Swiss cheese, across both halves of the sandwich. Paul's Reuben comes in at 7.6 ounces on one half and 8.5 on the other for a grand total of one pound, one ounce. That's a big Reuben. <laughs> Paul's Reuben measures five inches across and two inches tall. Both halves came in at the exact same measurement, which was good. That's a symmetrical sandwich. You get a good look here at the Thousand Island dressing, the corned beef, there's a generous amount. Here you're gonna see an attempt on the girth measurement, but the bottom half of the sandwich falls apart. So no girth measurement on this half, but that's all right. We're going to go ahead and reset and shoot for it on the other side. So we're going to go ahead and put this guy back into the box and save him for later and move on to the measurements of the other side. And like I said before, both halves come in at five inches. So we have a really good symmetrical Reuben sandwich. This is take two on the girth measurement for Paul's Reuben sandwich. This side ends up staying together and we get a girth measurement of 12 inches. This is the largest girth recorded in our six episodes so far. I just can't wait to start eating inside restaurants and not in my car. If you like this video, it would mean the world to me if you subscribe to my social media accounts.